Hey everyone, what's going on? So we have the Laddies Escalation Battle, and with only going up to 150, I apologize guys, they just keep on increasing the HP on all the final stages. I mean, we saw it on Volcanian, we see it on Laddies, just not going to be able to reach that far. So yeah, we only only going up to 150 for this Escalation Battle, uh, but yeah, starting off in 25. Uh, this one wasn't bad, this one was a boss stage, but it wasn't difficult, you have the Mega... Diazzi, if it's fully sped up, really good option. Uh, Zygarde Complete, which I am using throughout the entire Escalation Battle, and I would definitely recommend it if you were able to farm it. Uh, Gudra, also a good option for Unity Power, and then we have Xerneas for Power 4+. Plus. I mean, Vanillix is a good option if you want to leave one of those blank, I guess. Uh, that would be good. We did do that later on in the Escalation. But uh, yeah, able to beat this one itemless. Not a bad stage. Uh, if you have the team that I'm using, basically you should be able to do it itemless as well. As I got complete, very important for this escalation. So uh, if you have that last ditch effort, I would definitely recommend it. But uh, yeah, not a whole lot to say with this one. This one I felt was was quite easy. I mean, Shiny Mega Deonce would also do well to get rid of all the rocks instead of focusing on the barriers. But I just went with the regular Deonce. But uh, yeah, it was kind of interesting that we had a Latius Escalation battle because it's it's basically a Halloween theme. So it's like you kind of expect Halloween Pokemon, like ghost type. So I kind of expected a Giratina, one of the Giratinas, to be the Escalation. But not the case. We do have Latius. And uh, yeah, I would definitely recommend if you don't have the Megastone to go up to at least 50 because you do get the Latius Megastone. So uh, if you don't have the Megastone... Get to 50 and then you could stop or if you want if you're able to continue on awesome but um if not yeah you could stop at stage 50 but uh yeah able to be 25 itemless so uh not too bad not too bad um this escalation does only have 200 stages uh yeah for beating 25 we do get a mega speed up which is always nice i mean more mega speed ups awesome uh stage 50 Beating this, as I said, you do get the Latias uh, Megastone. Um, we did go ahead and use the plus 5. Uh, you don't need the plus 5. You could definitely do it itemless. Uh, but I just went ahead with the plus 5. Um, not sure if I actually needed it in this attempt. I don't think I did. I don't know. We'll see. But um, yeah, the, you either get the Latias Megastone for beating this or you get a Mega Speed if you already had the Latias Megastone, which is what I got. But uh, yeah, either way is is good, you know, Mega Speed Up's always nice, and, and the Mega Stone is always good as well. But uh, yeah, this stage wasn't bad either, yeah, I'm pretty sure I didn't need that plus 5. Just used it basically as a safety blanket, I guess. But uh, yeah, basically throughout the entire escalation, he disrupts with the rocks on each side and then some barriers. So again, Shiny Deonce, good option if you want to focus on the rocks. I felt like the barriers were... A bigger concern at least in my opinion but uh if the rocks are annoying to you you could definitely go ahead and go that route both of them are fairy types so they are super effective uh yeah so we have the zernies as well for power four plus mine is skill level i think it's skill level i'm trying to think yeah it's, it's skill level five yeah i did i did max it out that's right so um yeah, not not too bad, I guess. Not too bad. Uh, Gudra for Unity Power, always a good option. If you have it fully maxed out. So yeah, Stage 50 is not too bad. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we didn't need that plus 5 in order to beat it. And yeah, well, I guess we did need the plus 5. However... If we didn't use it, we would have been in last ditch effort range from Zygarde and probably would have been able to beat it. So we probably wouldn't have, have needed it, if that makes sense. But uh, yeah, able to beat stage 50 for that. And we are going to get that one mega speed up. Again, a Latius mega stone if you don't have it. So stage 50 is done. And then we have stage 70, which is another boss stage. Uh, going in with the same team, basically, for these early stages. Um, I'm also using the plus 5. Again, this is possible itemless. You don't need that plus 5. But I went ahead and used the, the plus 5 just for more of a comfort zone, I guess. 
Uh, yeah, again, there's really not a whole lot to say. I mean, it's basically, I think you, you have more moves, but for the most part, it's basically the same thing uh, over and over again because it's the same disruptions. So not a whole lot to say um, in regard to that, but yeah, so pretty cool, pretty cool. I guess it's been a while since Gladius was available, so it's, it's always nice to have it again. Why not? Yeah, able to... Yeah, this has a little bit more HP. It is a higher level, so it makes sense. Power of 4, activating. Uh, guys, I was meaning to ask you, do you like these Escalation compilations? Or would you prefer to see like stage 25, stage 50, stage 70 all in individual videos? Uh, they would come out quicker, I guess, if that were the case. Because I wouldn't have to wait to finish the escalation. Uh, is that something you would prefer? Or do you prefer these compilations? Let me know. Um, I mean, I don't mind doing either way. Either way it works for me. But uh, yeah, if, if you just want to see like 25 or 50, maybe the night that the escalation is available... Uh, that, that could be an option. I may consider that. But uh, yeah, getting back into it. Stage 70, not too bad. Not sure if I needed a plus 5 on this one either. So I probably didn't have to use it, but whatever. I mean, it's not really a super expensive escalation. Unless if you do want to go all the way to 200. But even then, it's not as bad as the Volcanian, in my opinion. So yeah, Shiny Deonsi helping out. And yeah, definitely didn't need the plus 5 on this, so it was kind of a waste. But um, just in case, you know, I don't mind spending the 800 coins to, to go ahead and do it. Because you do get an awesome reward for it, so it's definitely totally worth it. For beating 70, I think it was, let's see, I don't know what it was. A mega speed up. Okay, so that's another mega speed up. Wow. So that's pretty cool. Uh, stage 100, switching things up. We're going with Shiny Mega Rayquaza, Vanillux, Zygarde Complete, and we're leaving a spot blank. You do not need that attack power. I did try it without it. I came close to beating it, but um, I tr tried it twice with the plus 5. Wasn't able to do it. Um, I think I came close both times, but I just doing the attack power. Just to basically seal the win. I could I could have done with the attack bow without the plus five. But you know, I, I just I felt like it was worth it. Uh we do have Gumi just because of Vanillux. We're leaving the, the spot blank, the less spot blank, so it does give us Gumi. And Vanillux is able to shot out that. So definitely an awesome option. Uh but yeah, again he's disrupting with the same rocks and ice. Incredibly annoying, but it is what it is. Again, Shiny Mega Deonsi. Um, I'm going with Shiny Rayquaza this time instead of Deonsi. Uh, yeah, so... Yeah, it, it worked out pretty well. I mean, there's, there's a lot of blocks, so like the two the two taps are not really going to get rid of everything, unfortunately. Uh, Would have preferred the three tap, but I didn't think it was worth Tyranitar because just how, because of how slow he gets on, he Mega Evolves. So yeah, I mean, I would probably, you could definitely try it with just the plus 5, and I know that it is possible, but I think it's worth the attack power, but, but you could judge based on how you do, I guess. I mean, maybe try it itemless once and see how you do, and then you could decide. But uh, yeah, Zygarde Complete was pretty awesome for this escalation battle. I did use it throughout the entire time. Not really taking advantage of it just yet, but we do use it during this escalation battle coming up, so yeah, it's really, really fun to use. And really, hopefully you guys, most of you farmed it when it was available if you had the resources to do so. Because it, it does help out with a, not just Latius, but a bunch of other Escalation battles. A lot of Dragon types happen to be Escalation bosses, so definitely a good option to have. So, uh, yeah. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. 
Again, I'm kind of glad it's only a 200 stage escalation battle just because I didn't really... I guess it would be... The thing is, I want to fawn mimic you and I wanted to get this over with so I could go ahead and start doing that. So if we had like another three or 500 escalation, that would have delayed mimic you until next week maybe and there's stuff coming next week that I wanted to use, uh, wanted to farm, so... Yeah, right there we have that Zygarde complete doing over 13,000 damage. That is with the attack power. It would be like 6,600, I think. Um, but yeah, so we do beat stage 100. Not too bad. And we do get a skill swapper for that, so that's always nice. You always want the skill swappers. So stage 125, we are going in with the same team. And as you can see, I did go ahead and use the same... Plus five moves and attack power. I just, um, yeah, I felt like it was worth it. I didn't even try it with just a plus five. Uh, pretty sure it is possible with just a, uh, I, I don't know. It does have quite a bit of HP, so it's probably possible with a plus five and maybe a mega start if you're going to Tyranitar. But, um, yeah, I felt more comfortable with just doing the plus five and the attack power. So yeah, we have that annoying disruption again. But uh, yeah. So a uh, pretty cool escalation battle. Uh, yeah, so Gumi as the fit, as the extra support and as I got complete as usual. I'm uh, pretty sure Zygarde Complete came in handy in this battle as well. Uh, yeah, if you don't have Vanillax, um, Rayquaza, the regular one, has shot out if you have that. Um, I actually do have it for whatever reason. I just went with Vanillax instead, even though Rayquaza would technically be better. Uh, I don't think I really thought about it. I, I just, like, I, I Vanillax just came to, to mind when I was thinking... You know about a shout out user. So uh, yeah. This is not. I don't think this is a turbo escalation compared to Volcanian. But it would be annoying to go up to 200. Um, maybe not so much getting up to 200. Like it was with Volcanian. Um, with the, getting up to 500. But it would definitely be annoying to actually beat 200. Um. I'm not sure if it's possible without using the jewel. It probably is if you get an insane amount of luck. It has over 100,000 HP. So it's absolutely monstrous. It's It does give you 6 raise max level. So I'm not going to say it's not worth it. If you can do it, by all means, go for it. But uh, I, I didn't feel like I could do it. So I, I'm not doing it. But I, uh, yeah. I, I checked like the previous Laddie's Escalation Battle. And the HP, they just increase it so much it's just unbelievable i mean they're obviously doing it because you have better support pokemon now than you did back then so it's like on one hand i understand it but on the other hand it's like if you farm these these pokemon and get better pokemon let us let us have a better time basically keep the hp the same right i mean it, and what i say makes sense it makes sense to me in my head <laughs> but uh yeah not gonna do it anyway Last ditch effort coming in handy yet again. This one was over 63,000 HP. Yeah, on these escalation battles, when I make longer videos, I tend to get tongue tied, and I, I apologize for that. It's just, you basically run out of things to say, especially when it's like the same stage basically over and over and over again. So, yeah, you kind of run out of things to say. Uh, so, I do apologize for that, and I hope that's okay. Hope but uh, yeah, anyway, we do get three raise max levels for that. And now the last stage we're doing is 150. And we are going with the moves plus five megastar attack. But I did add the complexity just because uh, it was annoying for me. With uh, you, you do have a fifth support, which is blocks. And it's really, it was really annoying. So I just went ahead and added the complexity. And because I at this point, I knew I wasn't going up to 200. So I figured it was only one item attempt base a full item attempt or almost a full item attempt so i knew i wouldn't be using another complexity basically but uh yeah 
Uh, you don't need the complexity for this one, but I just went ahead and did it. And we did change up the team a little bit. We are using Tyranitar. Again, Zygarde Complete, that's not changing. Uh, Xerneas and Alola Ninetales, because we're not using a Disruption Delay. Um, I'm trying to think if Alola Ninetales did work out for us this time. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But uh, yeah, Tyranitar is excellent, just because it gets rid of three spaces that you tap, so... If you're going with the Mega Star, definitely a Mega that I would recommend. It's neutral, it's not super effective, but it does get the job done, even though it is neutral. Uh, yeah. Man, these disruptions are so annoying. I mean, and facing them over and over and over again on each boss, it's just, it's just really annoying. Uh, I remember them from the last Laddies Escalation, and I did not like them at all. So, yeah. I, I used to complete like all the escalations back in the day or whatever when they were but they were reasonable they weren't this tough in my opinion now that now it's just like you can't even complete them it's not even worth going after basically uh, so yeah 150 I felt like was reasonable with the complexity um, again it is possible without it but it's gonna be more difficult uh, but I know that it's possible so yeah. Yeah, so Alola Ninetales did go off. We do have that Freeze Plus going for us. Um, and that is basically going to help us out for this, this battle. Uh, yeah, you do get two level up for this. So if you're, you're not planning on going to 200 and you're planning on stopping, um, I, I would say, I don't know if the two level up are worth it. So you can stop at 125 and get the three race max levels. And uh, that probably would be uh, the best way to go. Uh, but if you are planning on going all the way to 200, good luck to you. More power to you. Um, then you, I guess, continue on. But, again, I, I don't know if I would recommend. I'm not saying it's not worth it, but it is going to be tough. So, uh, yeah, down to four moves left. We are in range of last-ditch effort, and that's going to be what wins us the game. Um, not just yet, but we are going to win. I think this has about, like, 67,000 HP. So it's really insane. So yeah, able to beat uh, 150. It has a lot of HP. Um, yeah, so that is 150. And for that, we do get to level up. And that's going to be it, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.